Hi, welcome to my next video. Today I'm going to show you how to rank a set of values in Excel or your data set. But what we're going to do is ignore any zeros that we have in our data set. So I use ranking a lot and sometimes you just don't want to include the zero in the results. So, so what we'll do first is we will show the normal ranking formula. So let's just put our rank in, put our rank in this column here and let's hit rank open parentheses in this data set. Let's make that an absolute reference. And then we want to be, we want to make that in descending order. You can just double click and we can see that 1249 is second, 1249 is second in rank. And actually number one is 1299 that makes sense and we have a few here blanks that have been pushed to number nine in the ranking well, we, we don't want that i don't i don't want the zeros in there so what we can do is we can rank to ignore the zero so the formula is if b4 is equal to zero we want to just ignore the zero and return a blank value. If the value is false and it and it's not zero, then we go ahead and we go ahead and then use the same rank formula as in the last one. Let's close our brackets and hit oh enter. Let's drag the formula down. So we can see now that our positions are still the same, but we do not have a ninth position of zero. So let's step through this formula. If B4 contains a zero, then Excel will return a blank cell. If the value in cell B4 is not equal to zero, then the value is ranked in the cell range B4 to B13 as normal. Just drag the formula down. And now we do not include a rank for our zero values. I hope you found the tip useful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. It really does help it. And if you want to ask a question, leave it in the comments below and I will answer it for you. And I'll see you next time for another Excel video.